I told my friends in the United States that I had um, gotten a job in Germany, actually it was a quite funny reaction that I got. What? And you're, you're going to be living in Germany where it's raining all the time and very little sun <laughs> in Bremen. My name is Mirta Teichberg. I was born in Argentina and I moved to the United States and grew up there. I'm a marine ecologist and I study coastal ecosystems and particularly in coastal ecosystems you have marine plants and so I am um, studying the ecology and physiology of um, macroalgae or seaweeds. I'm working in the Center for Tropical Marine Ecology in Bremen. We have an aquaculture facility where we have um, corals and macroalgae as well as many marine organisms and invertebrates that are living together in an environment. My research is important because um, the global environment is changing rapidly. Um, we have uh, global climate change, um, urbanization um, occurring in many coastal areas um, around the world, and all of these are impacting the coastal environments. And these coastal systems are important not only for the ecosystem health um, and uh, along the coasts, but also um, for, for our economy as well, with commercial fishing, for example. I love the city of Bremen, and I really enjoy the old city center, the Altstadt, with a lot of the medieval buildings. All Americans love to go to Europe just to see all of the, the old buildings and churches. In Bremerhaven, I visited the Ausfandero House just the first week I was in Bremen. This museum was important to me because my family, um, my great-grandparents and my grandparents are actually from Europe and immigrated to the United States and um, also to Argentina. In this museum, you actually get to experience it and feel it. And so it makes you feel closer to your ancestors and also to your roots. We often like to cook different um, ethnic dishes. And so um, I wanted to try to make some empanadas, which are common in Argentina. So something that I could bring um, from Argentina uh, to my friends here.